Our next topic, which is a comparably new shift in the networking field, is about software-defined networking and how moving to SDN defines generalized forwarding as a change in network layer's data plane. Remember, when talking about destination-based forwarding, we mentioned longest prefix matching, where the destination was checked against a range of addresses with a length of a specification, and based on the matching, an action, which was forwarding the datagram to a specific port, happened. Generalized forwarding generalizes the matching and the action. It generalizes matching to be able to match more than just range of bits in the destination address, and generalizes the action to be more than just forwarding to a specific port number. In software-defined networking, instead of table of prefixes that we use in traditional destination-based forwarding, we have a flow table that is computed and distributed by a logically centralized routing controller. This table includes the matching rules and the associated actions. Each flow is defined by header fields. Generalized forwarding matches packets based on a generalized set of rules. It also generalizes a set of actions that include dropping, forwarding, modifying, or sending the matched packet to the controller. It also maintains counters that keeps statistics of the matched packets. Let's see some examples. Rule one says, if an incoming packet matches with the source having the first 16 bits of IP address matching 1.2 and first 24 bits of destination matching 3.4.5, drop the packet. The second rule says, regardless of where a packet is coming from, if its destination has the first 16 bits as 3.4, forward the packet to port 2. Rule 3 says, if a packet is coming from 10.1.2.3, regardless of its destination, send it to the centralized controller. As you can see, this is much more than just matching a specific length of the destination against a table. This figure shows the different packet header fields that could be used for matching purposes in OpenFlow. As you can see, it is much more extensive and provides a lot more than matching only based on destination. This includes network layer header fields, as well as transport layer header fields and link layer header fields. The action performed on the matched packets could also include forwards, drops, modifies, and encapsulate and forward to the controller. While matching an action is in progress, counters keep track of packets and bytes in the fly. 